we could go upstairs. We'll talk to uh, Ulvik here in a minute. That must be the publican. Ulvik, I think his name was. Ulvik. The publican of the rooster and kitten. That is the oddest name. <laughs> Why not the cock and... Oh, yes. <laughs> He's the proprietor of this establishment. Let's see if what's going on back here. We've got some uh, steps leading to a cellar. Probably something very resistance related, wouldn't you imagine? Okay. I can't run in here, so we're just going to kind of saunter a bit. I want to go upstairs just to see what's up here. See if there's anything else interesting to look at. I should be getting home. Just one more. One more for the road. A bit of Dolmari courage to help me get started. And then I'll head home. Who are you talking to? Alvik doesn't have the most sophisticated or upscale clientele. And I'm sure he's happy about that. We could have fit more tables in here. At least they're not a raucous or unruly lot. Alvik keeps them in check. Huh. We'll just get close to the fire here. Warm ourselves. All right. Well, now we'll slowly walk back downstairs and talk to Ulvik. Again, this has nothing to do with our goals. But I just saw a place we could go in, so I wanted to go in it and check it out. Why not? Maybe we'll learn something. Maybe we'll get a new mission, a new quest, a new goal. Six shots of liquor and presently went for a walk. Come on, said the clergy. A man has his urges, but the witch only wanted to talk. <laughs> Oh, that's a good one. <laughs> Look at his apron. <laughs> it's a rooster and a cat on it. <laughs> that's funny. Welcome to the rooster and kitten, my good man. Now you may want to wait with your order until your friends arrive. What? You may want to wait with your order until your friends arrive? What? You may want to wait for the rest of your party before you order. I'm sure you're a busy man tonight. What? So, maybe this... Oh, you know what? Uh, I think this is where we're supposed to meet Inu and Liko once our uh, missions are complete. Why did you come back a bit late? Yes. After all, I'm sure you have much to do. This is the game's way of telling us to come back later. All right. That's fine. That's fine. I understand what's going on now. The rooster and kitten. I like how the kitten's riding the rooster. <clears throat> um, and then here is the gate that would take you to the tower. Yeah, I just want to look around and see if anything looks familiar is all. Well, something showed up there for just a moment, didn't it? Didn't it? Oh, just another Mercurian. People out at night, even though the streets appear to be safe. What's this thing? Yeah, this looks a lot different. I think... Is it down this way? Where Ben Rime's place was? I wish I remembered what it was called. Yeah, more pipes. The construction of the tube network appears to be picking up pace. There are wagon loads of metal pipes everywhere, and the laborers work into the night. Okay, so this was the checkpoint where the runner was coming through. Okay, well, unfortunately, I don't remember that part, but this part over here does look familiar. Let's see what's back here, if anything. Just because we haven't walked over here yet. Interesting. Little steps here. Oh, oddly enough, we could walk up. Pretty neat, huh? All right, enough sightseeing to the harbor.
What is that on that sign? A loaf of bread, maybe? A potato? I'm not sure. Habai Hain? Alright. In case you're wondering what that noise is, I'm pressing the mute button on my microphone. I need to clear my throat occasionally. Alright. Yeah, this uh, gate here leads to one of the harbors. Crate. According to the labeling on this crate, it contains flintlock parts. Hmm. Flintlock parts for the musket. According to the labeling on this crate, it contains flintlock parts. Okay. Good to know. Whoa. Uh oh. Patrolling guard. Hmm. Maybe we need to try to get past the guard. Oh, here's the shipment. That's the shipment I'm supposed to destroy. Uh, probably supposed to avoid this guard here. I'm gonna guess. Crap. Is he gonna come over here? Can we crouch? Ah, crap. He's gonna walk right over here and see me. Hello. What are you oh. doing here? Oh no. Oh no. Oh, okay. Mission aborted. Alright, so we just need to avoid this guy somehow. Where is he now? Okay, he's over there. Let's see, um Do I even have the opportunity to look at him? Before we did. Go on, get out of here! <laughs> okay. He talks to us like we're a stray dog. Alright, maybe he'll just stay there. Alright. There's black powder in this barrel. They use it for the muskets and cannons. It's a powerful explosive and propellant. Black powder. Imported from Azadir. Uh oh. Oh no, another guard. Crap, what do I do? How do I avoid these guys? I can't crouch. Nothing ever happens down here. This truly is the dullest assignment. Hey, you! Yeah, yeah, he sees us. Um, how the heck are we supposed to avoid being seen? I don't know, just run in here real quick and... Okay, there's a dude. He probably won't stray from his route. My veil helps. But if I get too close, he will oh, certainly okay. see something. So we just need to stay away from him. There's black powder in this barrel. They use it for the muskets and can black powder. Imported from Azadir. There's black powder in this barrel. Okay. I just wanted to see if he said anything muskets. else. A handful should suffice. Okay, we've got a handful of black powder. Okay. Alright, he's coming back. So let's run over here. Just kind of stay away from him. Let him go help, go along his route. And then we'll walk back over there. So this could be a little tedious here. Does he turn around? No, he comes over here a little bit. Okay. Still walking. Still walking. Okay, so I wonder if we just simply put the black powder in that fire thing there. Simple as that, maybe. So he's going to turn around and come back. We'll wait till he walks over the other side. Oh, he's going to stand here and talk to that guy? Oh, okay, he's turning around, he's coming back. Okay... Walk on by. Go on, Oops, get out of here. Son of a bitch, are you kidding me? I'll be damned. Alright, well, we'll just run over here and get this black powder real quick. That was, um... I thought we were okay if we stayed away from him. 
but apparently we oh a place item do I have the item on me now oh I do black powder use place item okay there's black powder there that should be enough black powder to ignite the barrels and blow the whole shipment to pieces okay that should be enough black powder to ignite the barrels and blow the whole shipment to pieces oh here he comes I'm not really sure how we're supposed to get away from him because he seems to see us no matter where we go. This looks like a good place to hide. I'm gonna hide over here. I need to stay out of his sight. Okay. All right. Let's see. Can I get some fire from this? Because now I need a source of flame. Okay. How do I? I can't interact with it. Don't see anything to interact with there. Can't interact with that. This must be the shipment Liko spoke of. The crates and barrels are all marked with the Azadi seal. Um Where does one get flame? Alright, let's do this again. Wait for this guy to walk away. Um Oh, Flint. I didn't see an option to pick it up when we were over here before, but, um, well, I still don't. Flintlock parts for the muskets. Oh, there we go. Flint pieces for the flintlock muskets. Here we go. Here we go. Get ready for this. Get ready for some pyrotechnics. All right. Okay, he's over there. We'll wait for him to walk back over to the other side. What's up, horses? How you doing? Are these two-headed horses? <laughs> two-headed, two-tailed horses. <laughs> I can't say I've ever seen those before, but this is the world of magic. All right, let's do this. Bring up our flint. Use the crate won't burn on its own. Ugh. I need to ignite it with something more flammable. What? What weapon Weapons. shipment? If the rebels, this must be the shipment Liko spoke of. Is this is this where I? Are all marked with the Azadi seal. Do I use this here? No. Damn it. Here he comes again. What the hell? So I got flint. Do, hmm. Do we need something else from in here? Is there like um, a rock or something that I could strike it against? Or. Whoa. Oh, here we go. Steel nails. That should work. Steel. Nails should nails. work. Imported from Western Azadir, I reckon. They're used to mount the pipes around the city. All right. Steel nails. Imported from okay. Western Azadir, I reckon. Let's get this stuff. Nail. Fresh from the steel mills. This might be of use to me. It might. Okay, let's see if we can avoid getting seen by this guy here. Okay, there he is. Keep on walking, buddy. Keep on walking. Okay. So do we need to combine these things? Let's see. Use. Okay, I can't combine them. Okay. Steel nail. Okay, I can't put that there. Do I do it over here, maybe? Damn it. Okay, can't use it there. Oh, oh okay, back out, back out. He's going to come back around here again. Here he comes. What the hell do I do? I have a nail. I have some flint. I can't combine them. I have this. 
Or I could take this. Nothing. Is there something else out here that I need? Maybe I need some paper or something, something flammable. Maybe that's what I need. Let's look around here. Let's see if there's any papers. Metal pipes. The pipes are manufactured both locally and in Azadia. And they bring them in by the boat. Steel nails, steel nails, steel nails, st steel nails. <laughs> imported from Western Azadir. How's it going? They're used what? to mount the. While my veil is active, they cannot recognize me. Not unless I want them to, or I act carelessly. You mean like this? If I'm quiet, their eyes glide off me, and I remain invisible to them. An Irhardian veil can be very effective. There's some like hay that these horses are eating over here. That's flammable, right? These two-headed horses. Yeah, they're eating hay. I can't seem to see it or look at it, though. Okay, so no hay. Oh, what's in here? I thought I saw something. Maybe it was just this. Oh, what was that? I'm sure oh, we'll learn more about those tubes soon enough. Right now we have other concerns. All right, just stupid They're metal perfectly pipes. They're engineered and sturdy. No expense has been spared in forging these pipes. I need paper, something flammable. Have I seen anything like that? I mean, a while back we had a um, flyer for that front whatever meeting. But um, that paper's gone. Well, doggone it. Hmm. Yeah. Well, I thought hay was a pretty good one. I thought I was onto something there. I thought that was a pretty good one. Um, oil barrel. Oh, okay. Oil will work. Oh, why didn't he say that? <laughs> okay. Leviathan oil. They hunt the great beasts for this precious fluid. It's used as illuminant and for lubrication. Okay. What? Well, can I pick it up? What's going on here? Am I supposed to just do it here? All right, what? Well, I can't I can't pick up the oil. Maybe I need a container for the oil. <laughs> All right, I already picked up the steel nails. It's just more steel pipes. The bucket here. I can't go up those steps, it would seem. Hmm. Um. Pipes. Pipes. Great. Yeah, I'm just kind of looking around in the hopes that something will highlight and I'll be able to pick it up. But, um, what the hell? I could, all I could do is smell it. Leviathan oil. They hunt the great beasts for this precious fluid. It's used as illuminant and for lubrication. Well. The construction of the tube network appears to be picking up pace. There are wagon loads of metal pipes everywhere, and the laborers work into the night. 
I don't think I'm going to find anything out there. Can I go up these steps? No. Doggone it. Huh. What do I do with this oil? Am I supposed to combine the... Wait a minute. Um, he's going to see me. Do we need to go get some more of this um, gunpowder? Doesn't doesn't look like it. Doesn't look like I have the option to. That should be enough black powder to ignite the barrels and blow the whole shipment to pieces. So the only thing. Weapons. If the rebels want. I can't interact with the weapons. The weapons. Enu suggested blowing it sky high. But Here how? he comes. Don't see anything over here. Hmm. I mean, it's obvious what I'm supposed to do. I'm supposed to blow that stuff up. I use the flint. I'm not real sure what the nail is for, though, to tell you the truth. The na oh. What if I tried to use the nail on the barrel? It doesn't look like I have that option, though. I thought I tried to do that. Let's see. Could maybe if I I don't know, maybe I could make this stuff leak, maybe. Let's see. Nail. Doggone it. Alright. What's the nail for? I don't know. I don't know. Um unfortunately I, I need to take a break now. I, I'm not real sure what the game does here. I, I hopefully it'll save where we are. If not, I'll get us back to this point before we resume next time. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I certainly did. If you did, won't you let me know by hitting that like button? Feel free to leave a comment if you wish. Let me know what you think about the two-headed horses or anything else about this playthrough. And if you're not a subscriber, won't you please consider subscribing? Thank you so much for watching. I do hope you'll join me again in the next episode.